In this video I will be explaining the origin story of Batwoman the Drowned. Before starting this video please consider subscribing to my channel. Bryce Wayne was born on Earth-11 to Martin Wayne, who like the fathers of various Batmans from other universes, was shot dead in an alley. She later became a crime fighter who was romantically involved with Sylvester Kyle before he was killed by rogue metahumans. In retaliation for the death of her lover, she went about systematically killing every metahuman to avenge him. Eighteen months after Bryce had killed the last superpowered being on land and also thought that she'd finally made her world safe, Aquawoman returned along with the Atlanteans from years of self-imposed exile, having spent that time hidden in the deepest parts of the ocean and claimed to come in peace. Bryce saw the feigned treaty presented by Aquawoman of Atlantis as a hoax to pursue their own agenda, being unable to trust anyone except for herself and her instincts. She also regarded Aquawoman and her group as more rogue metas and also a menace to everything they held dear while having no faith in the Atlanteans' efforts to sue for peace. Having been proven right when peace talks between the surface and Atlantis ultimately collapsed into violence, negotiations shifted to open conflict with Bryce regarding the Atlanteans as vicious and also untrustworthy invaders. Bryce sided with the surface, fighting and winning against an onslaught of Atlanteans led by the invading monarch and then stole Aquawoman's own trident before killing the queen with it, Bryce presumably hoping that the survivors would get her message of showing that the surface people were not to be underestimated. However, this victory came at a steep cost. In retaliation, the Atlanteans drowned Gotham City and most likely a large part of the world beneath the waves for the death of their queen. Bryce regarded this as a mere setback and began planning to adapt herself to the situation. In order to win her desperate war, Bryce performed surgical and genetic procedures on herself, imbuing her human form with vast biochemical augmentations, such as the ability to control water, breathe underwater, heal faster, and bolster muscular, skeletal, and bodily tissue density along with the capability to perform a type of dark hydrokinesis which could corrupt and convert those fighting against her into ravenous sea beasts under her command. She also designed her own army of hybridized sea creatures, called Dead Water. Her abilities were bolstered by her adversary's trident, and with it she was able to conquer Atlantis and drown the rest of the world. Not long before her world was set to die, Bryce noticed the bat signal that she had lit to signal hope and victory suddenly go dark and went to investigate. She was approached by the Batman who laughs when she got there, and he told her the story of how and why her city and her world was so broken and misaligned. He told tales about a multiverse sitting above the dark one nestled beneath it, hearing about how it was the perfected iteration of her ideal world and that both she and it were spawned from its nightmares. Bryce joined the Dark Knights of Barbados, taking on the moniker of the Drowned. The Drowned represents Batman's fear of going too far in the fight against superhumans, his love for Catwoman, and his inability to trust anyone but himself. 